I mean, how much have we got to see? I mean, it's amazing, really. Think about how much we've seen of the world that we wouldn't have seen if it had not been for this. Um, and I think, yeah, you, you tend to forget this um, when you've been doing it a long time. But that's that's the like the that's probably the main gift of it, of it all to see the world in that way. Hi, we're Lady Tron, and you're watching Talks on Indie Rocks TV. Well, Ruben and I lived in Liverpool then. Um, that's where we're from. Um, Helen was at university there. We met like basically at discos, and um, me and Ruben were both DJing then. Yeah, we ended up making music together. I guess sometimes, you know, the environment around us does influence us and it creeps in and you can't help it. But I mean, I think that a lot of the music that we make and the lyrics that we write are way more personal than that. You know, it's like things we've experienced, like uh, loss, love, um, just general like life events. I don't think we set out in the beginning to have a kind of sound or a kind of mood that the album's going to be. I think we just create, we just write, and then you know, further down the line, it might start to, you know, its form start to crystallise. And something that we're not kind of aware of until we get further and further into the process. In terms of the creative process, I don't think there's a certain moment when you hear something back. You know, the first time you hear something on big speakers in the studio, and, and in the, not necessarily when it's mixed and finished, but when it's you're in the process of making it, and there's this moment when you feel something that I don't really, I, I don't personally have a word for, <laughs> but it's a very, very distinct feeling, and it happens every time. It's just this visceral sensation when you hear something new, and, and you've all created it. It didn't exist before. And um, it, it touches you in a way that um, even later on, when the record's finished, you might, you might never get that sensation again. I think the excitement of like being on stage, you know, and like kind of interacting with people, connecting, that's quite a special thing. And like not many people get to do that, you know? So we're quite lucky that we had that opportunity. There's no love.